so cool. <laughs> what the fuck? Hello, my beautiful friends, and welcome back to a brand new Loki reaction video, season one, episode five. So last episode was quite amazing, quite really good. Really like Sylvie, the female Loki. Of course, I love Loki, and Mobius is growing on me. We found out that the time gods are not real. Something I had my suspicions about the whole time. And well, I was right. They're robots created by who? Maybe the black woman who is pure evil. Pure, pure, pure evil. I've been saying that from the start. Nobody was listening to me. And Loki and Sylvie were on Lamentus and they were falling in love. And I think that's what created a Nexus event. And Lady Sif showed up. Uh, I don't know if it's the same actress from the four movies, but if it is, then it's a really cool cameo. She's amazing because she shows up in a lot of things. So if, if it's the same actress, then I really like that actress because, well, she still plays her character and I like that. Also, there was an after credit scene where Loki was, oh yeah, Loki died by the way <laughs> as well. He got sticked. We don't know what happens when you get sticked, but he died. Or well died, and he was somewhere, he woke up, and I thought Odin was speaking to him, but it were all different Lokis, I guess? And Mobius also got sticked, so that means Mobius must be there as well. Right? Right. Really enjoying this show. Um, I think I'm just gonna jump into this one, doing a little marathon here, watching episode 5, and after this one, episode 6. I'm really excited, so I think I'm just gonna go. And you guys uh, will get my reaction. Let's go and watch Loki Season 1, Episode 5. What's it called? It is called Journey into Mystery. Let's go. Yeah, there are different Lokis. Was that a Black 4? Was that a Black 4 because he was holding a hammer? Or maybe they're all Lokis. I think they're all Lokis. Okay, that's the uh, elevator to the Time Gods. What? What is this? A destroyed Earth? A destroyed New York? What is this place? Where are we? Who are you? Is it the Void? That's Elias. We're his lunch. Come on! What? What did he say? What is that? Goliath? What is that? What the fuck is that? <laughs> what is that? This show is amazing. This is it, isn't it? This is where you dragged me after you stole my life. A fitting place then to take yours. And what if I said Loki wasn't dead? Uh, Not yet, anyway. I'd say you were lying. Maybe. I'm telling you this willingly. Why? Because I want to know who's at the top of this. I want to okay, know. Okay, she doesn't Lied know. She, she didn't know? Basically, the branch timeline isn't reset. It's transferred. To where? A void at the end of time, where every instance of existence collides at the same point okay. and simply stops. Why? I don't know. I don't trust her. Nothing ever comes back from there. I can help you if you trust me. I don't trust you. But I guess that Sylvie wants Loki back. Man, a pirate ship from Black Sails. A UFO. If you're Loki's, you should always have a plan. What are those? Peacocks? Well, someone please explain to me what the hell is going on? And now I'm surrounded by variants of myself, plus an alligator, which I'm heartbroken to report. <laughs> that isn't mine. Well, that's strange. This is the place where the TVA dumps its rubbish. And Elias, he ensures none of it ever returns. <laughs> oh, there's no such thing as an alligator tank. Besides, it's a better metaphor. He's overly sensitive like the rest of us. Right yeah. the park. You're telling me that thing's a low for you. <laughs> oh, Oh, that's hilarious. Okay. Why do you wear the horns? You let a child command you. You'll do well to respect the boy. This is his kingdom. Right. What was your nexus event, your majesty? I killed Thor. <laughs> Mobius is here as well, right? Thanos. Oh, damn. Was that a small four? What's going on here? What about the Void spacecraft? It's a spaceship designed to withstand the temporal void. It could conceivably take us to the end of time. Find Loki. Find the man behind the curtain and kill him. Together. I don't trust her. She doesn't want to kill the man behind the curtain. Miss Minutes, where are the files on this time craft? It's highly restricted. I might not even have clearance. Oh no, I think you would. If it's real. 
Yeah. How long? <laughs> Tell you what, you come out with your hands up and I'll put you in a time loop. Something not so bad. <clears throat> you can live out your days in a good memory. Do you have any good memories? Just one, really. I want to lament this. Probably the one on Lamentis. She just went there? She's self pruned. Good. And she's dead too. But she's behind it, right? Who else would be behind it? So, after we vanquished. <laughs> Tell them your story, Loki. Me? Nobody wants to hear about that. I, I would, actually. It's just, I've, I've been wondering. But well, we're supposed to die, right? Thanos kills us after Ragnarok. In my timeline, everything proceeded correctly my entire life until Thanos okay. attacked our ship. So you, you didn't try to stab him? Huh. I cast a projection of myself so real, even the mad Titan believed it. Then hid as inanimate debris. After I faked my death, I simply drifted in space. Oh. Away from Thor, away from everything. I thought about the universe and my place in it. And it occurred to me that everywhere I went, only pain followed. So. I removed myself from the equation, landed on a remote planet and stayed there in isolation for a long, long time. Man, yeah, he's all. How did the TVA <clears throat> find you? I got lonely. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I missed my brother. Uh -huh. And I wondered if he missed me, if anybody else did. But as soon as I took my first steps to getting off the planet, the TVA arrived. Wow. Because we, my friends, have but one part to play, the god of outcasts. Nothing more. TVA sucks, man. I'm going. You won't do either. You'll be brutally murdered. Well, so be it. That was my destiny to begin with. <laughs> you said a liath is what keeps us here. A liath, OK. You said it's a living thing. Well, if it lives, it dies. So I'm going to kill the shark. I'm going to kill a liath. And I could use all the help I could get. That was a good speech. <laughs> Why are you laughing? That was a good speech. Maybe the alligator will help you. Monsters. <laughs> Please let the alligator come with him. Oh! Ah. Hello. Which one of us are you? This is a nightmare. What? Himself? Is that after Fennel snapped his neck? I'm so confused now. He found himself there? Oh no. It's a dragon. Or whatever that is. Oh, who's this? Obvious? Yeah, this place is so cool. Okay, now I want to know about this. What is this? Apologies, my liege. I betrayed you. And now, I'm king. About that. You can't be serious. Come on. What did you expect? How about this one? My army, my throne. About that. <laughs> Beef-witted, half-faced scrubs. We had a deal! Why the hell is there an alligator in here? <laughs> oh. Okay, he's missing an arm. A hand. This is ridiculous. Animals. Animals. We lie and we cheat. We cut the throats of every person who trusts us and for what? Power. <sighs> Glorious power. Glorious purpose. We're broken. Every version of us mm. from ever. And Whenever one of us dares try to- I have a theory! The old Loki is the real Loki! That's why I need to get out of here. Nothing can This old Loki is Loki from Thanos. This is- I believe she's our only chance of- I'm right. I know I'm right. Okay, we'll help you. But approaching a liar is a death sentence. We'll get you to it. He's real Loki. I know it for sure. Because everything in his timeline went right until Thanos. And then he isolated himself and he missed his brother. The only thing that matters now is getting out of here and finding out who's behind all of this. Yeah. Great. How do we do that? We turn around. Turn around? I think it might be the answer. To what? We're going back to it. No, that's not it. Okay, Mobius. I guess you're not really a leader, but more a follower. Carl. What? Along the horizon. What are they doing? Your friends, Loki. Sylvie. Aww. These are my friends. Uh, well, are they, um, how best to put this? Uh, us as a child, <laughs> us in the future, and us as uh, uh, an alligator. I think the person we're after is beyond the void at the end of time. 
And if they are, that thing is just their guard dog protecting the only way in. Okay. Okay, so how do we get past the guard dog? I'm going to enchant it. <laughs> Listen, I've been down here a bit longer than you. I know I'm going to enchant it. Okay. She's pretty calm. <laughs> Pure evil. There she is. You had a link with the variant. I want you to tell me what drives her. Revenge drives her. Killing the timekeepers. But they turned out to be fake in case you forgot. So she'll be searching for whomever created them. You'll never find them. Not before she does. And why is that? You only want it. She needs it. Mm. They like her. A supporting character. Whoever created this place is in danger. I need to find them. Who did create the place? I'm so lost. I want to know. Uh, I, for, I for sure thought that she was behind it. Maybe she's in pure evil. You really don't remember him? I mean, TVA had arrested a lot of Lokis, but... No, I don't remember an alligator. <laughs> I mean, who's to say he's even a Loki variant? He's green, isn't he? <laughs> He could be lying the long con. Of course, that just makes him more likely to be a Loki. It's always the game within the game with you guys, which I respect. So just like that, you're turning on the very thing you devoted your life to. Well, it's never too late to change. Oh, yeah, he is a real Loki. I see it in his face. It's never too late to change. But that's so cool. That's such a cool story. So it's cold. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I don't even know what we're doing. I don't have friends. I don't have anyone. No. Well, you know, there are more important things, right? Right? Yeah, like like bringing down the TVA. I mean, saving the universe when you think about it. Well, there's no need to be dramatic, but yeah, kind of. Aww. Ah, it warms my heart. It's cute. It's really cute. Thank you. Pleasure. How do I know that in the final moments you won't betray me? Oh. Listen, Sylvie, I, I betrayed everyone who ever loved me. I betrayed my father, my brother, my home. I know what I did. <laughs> and I know why I did it. And that's not who I am anymore. Okay? I won't let you down. You sure? Because if we make it and the TVA is gone, there might be a timeline for you to rule. Ah. And then I'd finally be happy. What about you? What will you do when this is all over? I don't know. Maybe we could figure it out together. Maybe. What are those? They're disgusting. Okay, here we go. The Avengers 2.0, the Lokis and Mobius. I'm staying. Loki, I don't even know if this is gonna work. You go. I go. Wow. Loki, you're gonna need this on your journey. Go on. <laughs> oh yes. I hope you find what you're looking for. Is my theory wrong? He is our Loki, right? Or the real Loki. Well, he's the real Loki. You know what I mean? The Thanos Loki. Looks like you got away in the end. I always do. What will you do at the TVA? Burn it to the ground. <laughs> well, see you later, Loki. Aww. Thank you, my friend. Alright, here we go! Oh, big dragon of smoke. That's a big dragon of smoke. Ah, yes, uh, Thanos Loki. What if we don't have time to wait for a branch? We'll have to cause a distraction. Oh. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> He's sacrificing himself. Why are you doing that? I think we're stronger than we realize. Um, he created his own As Asgard. Wow. What are you doing? We're gonna enchant it! I don't know how! You do! Because we're the same! <laughs> oh. 
Is there an old mansion? I need to know who's behind everything. I have a guess. It's gonna be a Loki. I imagine that you have to wait. All right. Oh, that had no right to be as good as it was. I don't know. I I thoroughly enjoyed that. I really did. So the thing is, it got me. It got me. Loki and Sylvie talking with each other and. Sylvie asking him, just thinking about it, I almost, I get emotional again. <laughs> that just got me. There were no tears, but I did get really emotional. What the hell? That was just, that just hit me. That scene, the love they create between Sylvie and Loki is really well done because it usually is really cheesy and well, usually when shows create love stories, it's really cheesy. But for some reason, this wasn't. I don't know what it was, but it was just it just wasn't. Maybe because I know Loki, or we've known Loki for so long. We've known him since the first four movie. And then to see him get a love story so late, and they, they deliver it so well at the same time, it just makes it amazing. Them enchanting the, the beast. First of all, the beast was amazing. Just, I loved how it looked. It looked epic. It looked so epic. Ah, that looked like a cool beast. If this was like a video game or something, I'd want to fight that. It was created out of smog. It was a dragon at the same time. Oh, that was so cool. So, already points for that. Second, the Lokis that got introduced were really fun. I don't know what that was that he encountered himself and that he said, what did you expect? That was really weird. Well, everyone, they turned on each other, but why was that himself? <laughs> and the older Loki was so cool. I'm just gonna, they didn't confirm it, but I'm gonna use that as headcanon because that's really cool. If that's the, the same Loki uh, from our universe. Or, well, this is the same Loki as well, but you know what I mean. After everything that he had done, that he, because... Loki's don't die, so and then he isolated himself and he started to miss form. I think that could be the truth, or that's my head cannon for now because that's really cool, and especially because he sacrificed himself in the end for Loki and Sylvie to get through. So cool. The alligator, hilarious. Normally I don't laugh at these stupid jokes, but that was just so well done. I don't know why. I don't know why it was well done. Well, you re remember the the. Spider pig from uh, Into the Spider Verse, right? But that's based on a real comic as well, the Spider Pig, or whatever he's called. But he wasn't as funny as the fucking alligator. It probably was because the alligator couldn't talk. It was just so hilarious to see him there. At first, I didn't realize it was there. I thought because he saw these weird animals running, and then I saw an, an alligator with a fucking Loki helmet, and I thought that was an Easter egg or something. But it was one of the looks as well, so funny. Oh, that was so funny. The alligator, I want more of the alligator. Please bring the alligator back. I want more of it. That was so funny. Also, a lot of Easter eggs, like Thanos. Uh, something with Thanos was on one of the helicopters or something. I'm sure the ship, the big ship that got stranded there, that the Goliath, Goliath? I'm gonna call it Goliath because that sounds better in my head. Uh, that he destroyed. That's probably an easter egg as well. But there were so many. We, we saw little Thor, who was reaching for his hammer, right? I need to, I so need to watch this episode again. This was so good. There was so much in it. Uh, the evil lady, who is not evil at all. Maybe she is. Who I thought was behind all of this. Apparently isn't behind all this, but she's just really loyal. So, we'll have to see what happens with that. I'm ready. I'm ready for the last episode. Uh, do I have anything else to say? I don't think I do. I just enjoyed this one so much. 
I stopped giving ratings. I realized that now. Well, this episode gets definitely gets a 10 out of 10. And I think the last one... What did I rate episode 3? I don't remember. The last one probably gets a 9. It's just so good. It's really good. It's my favorite. This is definitely my favorite. And the possibilities is over top. I'm definitely expecting something big in episode 6. And I hope I'm not overhyping myself. But I am expecting... Something big, something with the multiverse. Maybe I'm overhyping myself. I'm gonna watch it right now. If you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did, don't forget to leave a, a like. It helps out a lot. Subscribe down below if you want to see me react to the last episode of Loki. We'll probably upload next week. Ring the bell if you don't want to miss any of my Loki reactions. And I will see you guys in the next one, which I'm really excited about to watch. Peace out.